Hello everybody, it is Aruba's viewer. I am here to show you another gear set video. Today I will be showing you Foundry's Bulwark. And you know it's a, it's what everybody wants, I guess. Um so here is the set. So you could run it two ways, right? You could either run it with the Matador, uh the adrenaline rush talent on the backpack. Or you can run it with protector. You can do either, depending on your playstyle, because protector is when your shield is damaged, you gain five percent bonus armor, and all your allies get fifteen percent bonus armor for three seconds, and it's on a three-second cooldown. It'll basically they will have like fifteen percent uh, bonus armor permanently, kind of deal. Or you could be a little bit more selfish and run a and rush. It's up to you. You do have a lot of armor regen. Um, so either or kind of works, you know. I am missing some armor from the glove and the backpack. I'm missing about 50,000 on the backpack and about 60,000 on the gloves. So I'm missing like 1.1 million armor. So I should really have like 2 million armor. So the armor region is currently at 83,000. You can get it to 90,000. Real close. You can get close to 90,000, right? So I have I'm missing 2,000. Well, basically 2,000 on the the knee pads, and I'm missing some armor, which because I get 1% armor from the backpack and 1% armor from Marikami, you could get to close to 90,000 with this. A little bit on the chest plate, but yeah, you, you get close enough, right? So this is how fast you get your armor back. So if I break it, there's, there's the armor region right there. It won't take you long to uh, to get it back. Plus the bonus you're going to be getting from the shield. Because, you know, the way found you Boar Quest is whenever you or your shield dam uh, takes damage, 20% of that is returned as to both over 15 seconds and I'm running it with the chest piece so it increases it from 20% to 30% so it's pretty nice I'm also running it with the the striker shield because the striker shield has regeneration compared to the other shields you can't use the the bulwark if you want to use the pistol instead you know it, it, it's personal choice you know it it really is his personal choice, but I recommend using the firewall. Yeah, let me let me put that real quick. You could use either or because the mods that the firewall gives you is it gives you eight percent shield health, which is more than you could get from anything, and eight percent active regeneration compared to five or shield health, whatever you want to run. So it's just more. It just repairs more. But it's up to you how you want to do it, right? You could use any gun, but since you're a tank, you'll most likely be using a Scorpio. Because, you know, that's what tanks do. It's just what tanks do. There's an other way to run this build. If you want a little bit more DPS, uh, you would run it with the Arquebus holster, if you want, then you could either run a Gilligard for additional bonus armor. I mean, like that five percent total armor. Just get a little bit more armor on it. You you do have fifty percent weapon damage, or you could run a shotgun or you know build some armory for more armor regen. It depends what you really want to do with this build, right? So if you want more DPS, use the Precarious holster instead. But your armor regeneration is going to go down. You're going to have about 50%. So you have a little bit more than half. But, you know, you're losing out a little bit. If you run it this way, you would get your armor back about this fast instead. Both of them are pretty fast, but the other way was faster. As you can see. But you do, you do, ha you do get a lot. So this is Foundry's set. This is a PvE build only, okay? I I wouldn't use this preferably, but some people like being tanks, right? And if you want to be a tank, 
I'm going to assist you in the best way as I can because tanking, tanking is a little hard, man. Like, there I have full armor now, but the way I would preferably want it would be using the holster, putting on, you could either put hazard on it or armor region. I will put armor region on it. I would recommend putting hazard at least on the backpack just to get a little bit of hazard because a little bit of hazard goes a long way. You could use, again, you either use Matador, I mean, you either use Adrenaline Rush, or you either use Protector. It's personal preference. Well, you want to give more of a team buff to Protector, if you want to stay alive as long as possible through Adrenaline Rush. It's up to you. And I recommend Protection from Elites on all your mods. Protection from Elites. Because this is a PvE build. For sure. For sure a PvE build, so Protection from Elites everywhere. I don't think there's much from this gear set that you could do because all it does is give you shield health, total armor, and armor regen. So you have a lot of armor regen, but you don't uh, you don't you don't do too much besides tank things and stun them with the Scorpio and you know just just exist. That's why I recommend using the the striker shield instead. Gives your team buff too. But anyways, have fun with a tank build if you want to run this, guys. Enjoy yourselves. Have fun out there.